I just woke up. This morning I farted so loudly that it woke me up. And then I scrolled on TikTok for 10 hours and then went back to sleep again. So I thought I'd find some inspiration from millionaires. Maybe uh, to sort myself out a little bit. So we're going to be watching some cringe millionaire morning routines. Uh, who threw the word cringe in there? Are you talking to me? That is rude. It was me. Don't tell him. Don't tell him I did that. I can still hear you. So this is the morning routine that made this guy millions and gave him a bionic arm apparently as well. Look at all this B-roll in my face. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just spat on you. Um, someone had a cr someone got a bit angry last night. Get it? I'm I'm insinuating he punched the pillow. Why did why did that become a thing out of nowhere? By the way, people are just doing this shit now. And then they just leave and then they just leave those pillows everywhere. That's this that's in fashion or something. I didn't know like a way you could plump a pillow could be in fashion anyway. But now they just do they just be doing this all the time. Looks like a curiously cinnamon. My fat ass would eat them if I did that. Look at that. It's got ears back there. Can you see it? Nope. No, my fat. Sorry. Can you nope. See it? Nope. What about now? That's how you know someone is someone's got a fucking a serious morning routine when their pillow looks like that. You walk into someone's crib, their pillow looks like that. You know the toilet's clean as well. Every day I find myself waking up naturally around 7 a.m. Everyone wakes up at 11 p.m. in cold sweats. These these are the best clips as well because we know he's not asleep because he set up the camera. <laughs> just the thought of it, just the thought of it. It's very funny and tickles me all over. Tickles me pink. Oh, oh, now all of a sudden, Ish has entered the chat. Is Ish in the, is 7 a.m. in the room with us? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Because 7 a.m., say you wake up at 7.37, technically that's 7 a.m. But then 7.37 is also kind of like, well, it's closer to 8, so technically it's 8. So if you wake up at 8, then you're sort of waking up at 7-ish. And if you're waking up at 8, Eight is so close to being nine on a spiritual level. And when, once you get to nine, it might as well be 11 a.m. And if you're at 11 a.m., you've hit midday. Because brunch, you can't have brunch at 11, it's too soon. And then once you're at midday, it's 3 p.m. Once you hit 3 p.m., the day's over. So 7, 7 a.m.-ish could be any time between seven and three, in my opinion. But first thing he does is open his blinds. Hmm, I, mm, liar. I think first thing you do is open your eyes. Someone clip that, that's a fucking legendary line. Looking at the New York City skyline every morning gets me amped up for my day. Wait, did it say that twice? Gets me amped up in my day twice? That's how fucking amped it gets him. It gets him so fucking amped that he gets amped up twice in an actual fucking row by the New York City skyline. This guy's Spider-Man or something? Looking at the New York City skyline every morning gets me amped up for my day. And gets me amped up for my fucking day. <laughs> and not to mention it gets me amped up, by the way. Oh, he should have added this to his morning routine. Subscribe to Italian Batch. And you should all do it now, because technically this is still, this could be part of your routine. Do it. And gives a job, wait. I forgot to read because I was getting distracted by his muscles. Oh, I'm getting distracted by his muscles, sorry. Hell yeah. I will say, taking nothing, um, I don't want to take anything away from this guy because he's clearly very successful and has worked for it, so fair play. But I'm the cringe police. I'm on patrol in your district, and I'm going to take you down for a long, long time. Oh, he just moved his wig piece. He just moved his wig piece back. I don't know if he's alive in there. Who else stares at themselves so intently when they're putting on deodorant? It's a sexual thing for him, I think. Um, you forgot to chop the pillow. Hey Google, play my AC morning playlist. I think he dubbed that because that was so crisp. It was like set into a mic, but he didn't have a mic there. Hey Google, play my playlist, wherever it is. So when he chucks the aircon on, he has a playlist for it. 
That's how much he's got his shit together and how much I don't. I don't have an aircon playlist. Water in the fridge as well. Wow. I don't know if I could, I don't know if I could do this, you know, I've tried this before where I have like a regimented routine, but then, like, especially with the whole water thing, it's like, oh, I've got to finish this before I finish my workout. The amount of water you need each day really does vary. And so some, some days I'm f trying to yam this water down. I'm a bloated little piggy before my workout. And if someone pushed me over and I fell on my front, I'd pop. Water would probably come out of my butt and mouth and go everywhere. And then other days, I wake up like a fucking raisin. I wake up like a raisin. You could pour, you could pour the Atlantic Ocean on my body and I would just absorb it and still be thirsty afterwards. Some, some days it's like that. He got all that done in half an hour? In one half an hour? He got all that done? He's filled up his water bottle. He's made his bed. He's drawn his curtains. He's put a t-shirt on. He's done his face. Did he shower? I don't think he showered yet. And he's ready to fuck at 7.30. I was fidgeting at 7.30. That's what I was doing. <laughs> oh, it's a thumbnail. I thought <laughs> I thought this was like a like an image he just put up to remind himself like this could be you, but this is you right now. Stay this stay this version of you. You could be dirty, not looking great, or you could be a handsome businessman. It's your choice. But no, it's a YouTube video. What to do when a girl looks at you? Hmm. <laughs> You don't need a video for that, guys. All you have to do is this. 99% of men look better when they wear these five things. Underwear, trousers, t-shirt, socks, sunglasses. Seven small changes to appear more attractive. Learn to twerk again. Learn origami. Learn how to use a tech deck in public. Learn how to do a backflip. Wear heelys. Learn to run on all fours quite fast. If you see me looking over there, by the way, it's me looking at myself. Oh my god. It's like I'm on FaceTime right now. I'm just staring at myself when I'm talking to you. Oh, this is why you're lonely and how to fix. <laughs> Please release that already. The 10 minute morning routine that made me millions. That's what he's shooting right now. The old money hairstyle. Why well, you need to get this haircut today? This, I'm guessing this is this haircut. All the like uh, men's health, men's attractiveness things, people all look like this. They all have this haircut. They all dress the same with like, they'll always wear a muscle fit t-shirt. <laughs> They'll always have like a long line muscle fit t-shirt that goes down to their knees. Um, no hem on that thing. And they've got long hair that flicks back a little bit. And they all think that's that's the best. Have you seen a Mohican? Have you seen how cool they are? This just got a snack laid out as well. And his name in case he forgets. <laughs> the snack is so neatly fucking laid out. I'm gonna be honest, sometimes I'll see a crumb on my desk and I'll eat it. Cause I think I know what it is. Is that the same? Are we the same for that? Yeah, he's about to chop that down. That's an unfortunate sound effect. Can I just say though, I half seven having a ch having a chocolate bar. I know I know who who's got their shit together out of us now. It's become apparent to me. Do you ever he hear the rule no sweet treats before twelve? I came up with that. Just saying, guys. I'm just saying. You think you know someone? Robotic. I know what you're thinking. I probably went to fashion school. No, I didn't. Just working hard made me find this t-shirt. Eight twenty. Oh, is he's about to have a guilty pleasure. He's about to have a wank in the fridge again. That guilty pleasure of his. No, he's having a pre-workout. Same thing though. There's no, I'm sorry, there's no way you take a uh, moment, a quick moment of gratitude every time you sip your pre-workout at 8.20 a.m. and look out the window. That's a meme. That's not real. No one actually looks out the window while they sip their morning drink, do they? It's not even sipping it. Look at his lip movement. There's nothing happening. Oh, that's a cool transition, though. I'll give him that.
He's working out. I knew he was ready to fuck. So, yeah, one second he's listening to an audiobook, the next second he's listening to pump up music. One second Harry Potter's fiddling around in Diagon Alley, and the next he's just listening to Lizzo or something. I don't know. I don't know what people, I don't know what human music is anymore. This bit, um. Oh, you fucker! He got me! And you know, I was actually just thinking as well, after you said that, I was like, I do really want to get a whoop as well. I've been meaning to get a whoop. I really have. Whoopies. Whoop, are you picking up what I'm putting down? Do I have to keep saying this? Oh, I think I could really use a whoop right now. Really wish there's a way of getting one. Hey, whoop, I'm skipping through, I'm skipping through the ad. If you want one of your own, you gotta buy it from me. Daily hair gummies. Time for daily hair gummies. Oh my god, he's got his food ready. If this is another advert, I'm gonna fart. Daily hair gummy. What do you think's in that? More human hair? To encourage more human hair to appear? Because human hair is like a pack animal. It likes more human hair so it can grow. Cooking is so time consuming to be fair, so. Look how much, yeah. I, this is feeling like an ad, guys. I don't know if I'm gonna be slapped with an ad right now. Or maybe he It does look kind of delicious. No, he's fucking with me. He's fu this is a fucking ad. I'm um, gonna have a quick peek down here to see if there's an ad. No, oh, maybe not. Thickener spray, I could use that. I was gonna get a BBL, but otherwise. I don't think it's an ad. I think he just really enjoys it. <laughs> he really enjoys that potatoes egg thing. What time is it right now? What time is it right now? For me, this would be about 7 p.m. This is his breakfast. Yeah, for me, it's about mm, between 7 and 11 p.m. And I'm winding down. <laughs> for me, after that, I've fallen asleep, to be honest. Oh, I can see the time here. Let's see if he lies, all right? It's 11.42. Yeah, pop a pro prote shake as well. Scrotum shake. This is sort of drink that tastes like ass, but you know it's good for you. But, pe but people are always like, oh, I'm putting you on right now. This is the most delicious way of getting in your protein. No, it's not. It tastes like fucking poo and shit. It tastes like poo with blueberries every time. Every single one of these drinks tastes like grass, blueberries, and shit and poo. But you know it slaps for your system. <laughs> He's fucking lying. Oh, I knew he was fucking lying. Okay. I can't believe I caught it. Has anyone picked up on that? The time said 11.42. What does this guy say? 9.30. This is what I was saying about wake up about seven-ish. Maybe he's got his times right, and, uh, timings right in the sense that these things has, have taken as long as he's saying they're taking. Like it's been two hours since he's been awake, two and a half hours. But seven-ish is about 9 a.m. he wakes up. Nine is seven-ish. Don't lie. Oh. You eat this in less than five minutes. Run that back. I saw the iPad again. Let me see what the real time is. Tw it's been almost half an hour since the since the last clip. Since the last... 11.46, he was doing the food, which took three minutes in the oven. Half an hour later, he's eating it. Not gonna lie, this takes me two minutes to eat. Less, less than five minutes? Let's find out. Oh, sorry. Oh, I don't know what time it is anymore. I'm... My detective skills have gone. Oh, so that took him, it took him five minutes to do it. It's now 9.35, is it? You like to shower in the morning. You like to shower at midday! You fucking liar. It's probably a case of like, he's filming it um, as if this is, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm not defending him anymore. I was about to say, oh, he's probably filming this as if, oh, this this is my routine, but because I'm filming it, it's taking longer, so I'm just giving you an idea of what it would be. But it took you half an hour to get the food out of the oven. Maybe he doesn't have oven mitts. And every single time he's there, go, hot, 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 hot. This is technically another brand deal, but he he owns the brand, so. 
who's winning. He's gonna tell he's gonna hit me with the okay now it's 9.36. So I did all that in one minute. Whilst you were being a bitch, I did all that in one minute. <laughs> whilst you were you you were being a fat little bitch sat at your desk watching me blow dry my hair. I did it in a minute long. And now I'm ready to drive a Lamborghini. Finish it off! Finish it off! There's just way too much emphasis on getting doing the fucking body all the time. I think people want to know, yeah, fair enough, work out, do your work, but there's so much going on with the face and hair and body. I can't fucking take it. It's taking up so much of the video. I'm not watching him lather up. Sorry, I'm not doing it. Now he's in something casual and comfortable. Let's fucking go! It's 10 a.m. and the team's arrived. What? I'm a little bit confused. One, it's not 10 a.m. Two, we have a team now. When were you gonna tell me? Good morning. Good morning. It's Christmas every day around here. Mm -hmm. We got a pack for our leg. I'm leaving tomorrow super early. Okay, great. And I changed your. <laughs> this is dubbed over, I think. <laughs> Unless they've got a boom mic hand handed over. I don't know, this is kind of making me uncomfortable, to be honest with <laughs> you. This bit is really strange to me. Window seat. So I'm going to then say window seat, and then I'm going to celebrate and walk off, okay? She's like, yeah, okay. Yo, this came out tough. What? It's that's, tough. That's raw. <laughs> what the fuck's going on with their fucking... <laughs> with their words right now? Whoa, that's tough. That's raw. That's tough. The lighting, it's raw and tough. That's fucking dope and tough and shit. And let's also ask Brian and Kat to go through them in case they see something they really like. I think this is so strange because the whole video has had no voice in it. And it's just been text on the screen and now all of a sudden he's just filming his conversation. <laughs> it feels like a weird part to put in a morning routine. Like this would be the part that you wouldn't have the voice in and you'd be like, oh, then we, me and my team went through some stuff. You'd put that text on the screen. It feels weird they've done it this way around. So we have to shoot enough for the entire time I'm gone. So I'm thinking we do that sandwich method. <laughs> so we're going to do the sandwich method video, like on how to make the most uh, CEO sandwiches. And the pants, pants are making you the most money as well. We're gonna be doing that video. And seeing if women can pick the broke person in the room. We're gonna try that too. I've been making notes here and uh, let's just say my morning routine is gonna look a little different tomorrow morning, where do we? I'm not gonna be waking up at 11 p.m. in cold sweats anymore, ready to start the day. I think I'm gonna be up at about seven-ish, like midday give or take, ready to fuck. Hey, look at me right now, look at me. Don't worry if your routine doesn't look like this. It doesn't need to. Your routine is personal to you. And what works for you works for you. What works for him works for him. So if you're the sort of person that beats themselves up after getting up a bit late or, oh, they didn't eat so good today. Or I missed the workout. Who cares? You're going to live forever anyway. You're welcome. Just do it tomorrow. It's called procrastination. It's the most efficient way to live. Trust me. I've been doing it my whole life. I even procrastinated this video. It's supposed to be uploaded today. That is the end of the video. I am actually gonna, I'm gonna go and wake up now and get ready to, to do my routine. Um, this is all a fever dream. Thank you for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share this to your family group chat so they can get their shit together. I'll see you in the next video, most likely. Or the one that's hovering on my face right now. I'll see you in that one as well.